today's subject is a circa 1972 Lejeune Pro. I have owned this bike since approximately 1973. I purchased it through uh, Walt of Walt's Bike Shop. He had a racer friend who was wanting to get rid of it and I purchased it about a year old for a sum of $200 which of course was quite a chunk back then especially on my college budget. The bike is not a restoration. I guess you would call it a resto mod. However, I have attempted to uh, keep it pretty much French. You have to pardon the shaky camera. I don't have a steady cam. The original crank set was a strong light 93 undrilled rings. So you see this is a 93 yet, but it does have the 105 uh, drilled rings front derailleur with simplex criterium and as you see this is now a simplex super LJ gold of course when I try doing this everybody starts coming by the car start starting up oh well tough luck this is simplex super LJ gold rear derailleur One of my uh, friends has dubbed this bike the Pimp Lejeune. Frame was refinished about oh three years ago by Franklin Frame. The decals were provided by Velocals. I um, commissioned these decals, provided him with all the information on them. Overall, they're a very good job. However, the blue in the Lejeune and in a couple of other places is not as dark as it should be but still a very nice representation I imagine if you uh, approach the printer you'd be able to get the correct blue on that gold uh, levers simplex retro friction originally they were uh, simplex and uh, there was many other levers between now and then <laughs> this is an Edco super competition headset Hubs are Perrin, also known as Policier. They are a sealed bearing high flanged hub. They are laced three cross to gold Mavic OR10 rims. Allegedly, when I bought these, this was a new old stock wheel set. However, it was obvious when I got it, it wasn't, but for the price that I paid for it, I figured I would, didn't do too badly. Now, of course, this is not a French brake set. These are some tours superb. I use these because I modified the bike some time ago, or actually changed components out would be a more correct phrase. And at that time, I put these brakes on it, and I like them a lot. They stop the bike. Moving up here, a Bolari gold bar. The wrap is handle bra, leather, a polished Pipo stem. And the levers are diacomp arrow. Black is all Reynolds 531, and even though it is, it has a Nervor steerer on it. And that's not too unusual from what I can determine. At least two others of my Lejeunes that are all 531 have a Nervor steerer. This uh, seat post is a simplex alloy. And the saddle is the original Brooks Pro 
that I got with the bike. It is my most broken in saddle and by far the most comfortable. Again, apologies for the uh, shaky cam. I've been trying to figure out a steady cam. view of the simplex levers. The uh, red, white, blue stripes are painted, done by Franklin Frame. Another plug for them. Very reasonable work excellent work. They did the pinstriping or lug lining I should say. I know some people are screaming sacrilege because I'm using clipless pedals but I find them more comfortable. And you know what the hey they're red. Chrome was redone by Franklin Frame also. And as you can see, the lever reads Policier. Sound to a superb rear brake. The original would have been Mafoc, Mafoc, however you wish to pronounce it. My knees creak when I kneel down there. It's a Suntour Ultra 7 freewheel on there. Oh, I'm sorry, no, that's a Shimano on there, isn't it? My bad. And there you get a nice view of the Mavic logo on the rims. Tires are Continental Sprinters. And a little closer look at the uh, Simplex front derailleur. And after this, we're going for a ride. It's 70 degrees here. Hope you enjoyed it.